So today I'm talking about a Honda with the P0453 code, what it is and how you go about fixing it. So what is a Honda P0453 code? Well, it's a fuel tank pressure sensor high voltage. And what does this mean? Well, there's a sensor that monitors the EVAP system and the EVAP system is for emissions. It keeps all the gas vapors in the gas tank from, from escaping and they get sent back to the engine to get burnt off. And inside of this EVAP system is a sensor that monitors a vacuum so that it knows that there's no leaks or anything like that. So this sensor that's in the EVAP system is showing a problem here. So what are some possible causes? Well, it could be the sensor, it could be in the harness or in the wiring, it could be electrical short in there, so you gotta check that. And it po possibly the ECM, but that's pretty rare. So usually it's gonna be the sensor or the wiring. And what does this sensor look like? Well, it's just a small device and the location can vary. Quite commonly, they're located on the charcoal canister. Now this is gonna vary, so you need to Google your Honda but they can't be on the charcoal canister or the fuel pump. Those are very common locations. So the first thing to do would be Google your Honda, your particular Honda, and find out if if it where it's located at, if it's on the charcoal canister or if it's on the fuel pump. If it's on the fuel pump, it's usually behind the seat. And if it's on the charcoal canister, these are usually up underneath the car by the gas tank. It could vary again. So again, you're gonna have to Google that and find out. So what do you do if you get a P0453 code in a Honda? Well, the first thing to do is Google this fuel tank pressure sensor, where it's located. Find out if it's on the charcoal canister or find out if it's on the fuel pump or where it's located. And then go and check out this wiring harness. Be sure that it's good because, because a bad wiring harness or bad connection, open or short, that could cause the same symptoms as a bad sensor. So you're going to want to make sure that that harness, that there's no, that there's no electrical issues. And then if you don't have no problems with that, then you can go ahead and replace the sensor. They're usually low cost items around 50 bucks. It can vary again, but they're not super high cost items anyways. And some other things to keep in mind is that while rare, you know, the anything involved in the EVAP system can, can potentially cause issues. So if, if you go through all these steps and it doesn't solve anything, keep in mind that things like the gas cap that help seal the, the fumes in when the car is running, can cause issues if it's leaking or something like that. A purge valve or the EVAP canister can cause issues too. Those are three main components of the EVAP system is the pur purge valve, the gas cap, the vapor canister, and of course the hoses that run between everything. But most of the time it's gonna be something to do with this fuel tank pressure sensor. So that's basically it. I just wanted to give a real quick brief overview of what you could do if you had a Honda with the P0453 code and how you go about fixing it. If you have anything to add, please comment down below. If you have any questions, ask me and I'll try to answer them. If this video helps you, please click like, please click subscribe, and have a good day.